Pressure is building on the 29 people named as electors for Donald Trump. Posts on social media call on the 29 to vote for someone else or face recall. There are a lot of folks out there who won't give up. Uh, it's a little disappointing that they're so vigorously trying to change the course of the election. Lee County State Senator and GOP elector Lizbeth Benequisto is getting an earful. Read the postcards that come to my home and you know, some of them vary. Very. Uh, some are inappropriate, but you know there's free speech in this country, so everyone has a right to share their opinion. I just fundamentally disagree with what they're saying. Electors meet here in the state senate chambers at two o'clock Monday afternoon, and protests in the Capitol are planned. In the Federalist Papers, written to sell the new Constitution to America, Alexander Hamilton described the Electoral College as a sort of backstop to keep someone unqualified from winning the office. Full-page newspaper ads are telling electors they're free to vote their conscience. But even the state Senate's Democratic leader is disappointed. The election is over. Um, I think he's won. The way our system is set up, the Electoral College is the vote. The Secretary of State's office did a run-through of the vote ceremony Thursday. No votes are expected to change. Electors in Florida must take an oath to support the winning candidate. Reporting from the state capitol, I'm Mike Vasilinda.